Hi, my name is Pierce Randall and welcome back to the Great Plains product maintenance video series. I'm here with a handful of different bearings that we use in our planting and tillage equipment and today we're going to go through a little bit about the maintenance, how you service the bearings, and when and where they're used. The first thing you'll see here is, is the six lip sealed double offset tapered roller bearing which is used in a lot of our heavy duty tillage applications with individually mounted blades. Um, an example of this would be in the Max Chisel um, or some of the short disc models that are out there as well. Um, these double offset tapered roller bearings do a really good job of handling side loads from different angles um, and at higher speeds, which is why they are used whenever we have an individually mounted blade. We also use these in a lot of our transport axles as well. Another style of bearing that we have here on the table is a sealed ball bearing used in our opener blades on our drills and planters. We use a three lip sealed uh, ball bearing style that has a hardened sealed face so that if you do have dirt or rocks or debris that get behind the bearing cap, it protects the seals better than any other bearings um, typically found in, uh, in other models out there. The bearing is a special agriculturally designed uh, bearing, so what we have is a really, really um, well-built, heavy-duty seal to keep that contamination out. And then when it comes to the internal bearings, there's actually a little bit more tolerance in there to handle the, the shock loads, to handle if there is any dirt or uh, contamination that gets in there. Some of the other manufacturers use uh, very precise, high-speed bearings, which don't handle that contamination well. Um, so it is a special Great Plains design and we've had for a couple of years now and we have a lot of really good luck with that. And the goal for that bearing is to last the same length as your opener blades do so that when it's time to replace the blades, you replace the bearings and you're on your way back to the field with an all new, uh, all new blade and bearing assembly. The other style of bearing here that we have on the table is a heavy duty ball bearing style roller bearing. Uh, with a six lip sealed as well. And these are used in a lot of our uh, heavy duty tillage tools as well, such as the 7000 series disc and the Turbo Max. Um, these bearings, uh, while they are a, a ball bearing and sealed, uh, they are totally maintenance free. Um, unlike the tapered roller bearing that can be rebuilt every couple of years, these things are going to go for the life of the blades as well. Um, and then every so often when it's time to replace blades after a couple of seasons, we recommend going through and replacing the bearings all together when you do that. So those are a couple different styles that we use in, in Great Plains equipment. Um, they all serve their purpose and because they are all, they are all maintenance free and grease free, we actually get really, really good bearing life out of these because it's, it's very easy to over grease or under grease so the biggest thing that we want to talk about with all of these bearings is that the, the seal and the protection of the internal components is the most important part as contamination is the number one reason why bearings fail. So when it is time to replace bearings or other components on your Great Plains equipment, we do recommend shopping Great Plains Fresh Start parts to make sure that the original components that your equipment was designed to be operated with are the same components that get put back later on to keep your time in the field up and running and minimize downtime. 